The first thing to do when you receive your HuddleCam HD camera is read through the included manual. This camera series is available with options for an integrated 3x wide, 10x, 20x, and 30x optical zoom lens. The only main difference between the HuddleCam HD 3x wide, 10x, 20x, and 30x camera models are the lenses, which differ in optical zoom and field of view capabilities. As you unbox your HuddleCam HD USB 3.0 camera, you will find the camera, a power supply, an installation bracket with hardware, a 9-foot USB 3.0 cable, an RS-485 adapter, an IR remote control, the user manual, and a serial control cable used for joystick controllers. Let's start by plugging the camera into the included power supply and clicking the on switch. The camera will begin movement momentarily. Now it is time to plug the included USB 3.0 cable into your camera and into your computer. Note, all HuddleCam HD cameras utilize the UVC USB USB video class drivers that are built directly into Windows, Mac OS, and Linux to bring HD video into your PC via the device's USB port. When your device successfully recognizes the camera, your device will register the HuddleCam HD camera as an imaging device. You can see this in the Windows Device Manager program. Type Device Manager into the Windows search tool to see this. Once the camera has come to the home position, you will be able to select your camera inside your favorite video conferencing software. We can also see that our camera is available in the device manager of Windows. Let's test out the camera's pan, tilt, zoom functionality with the included IR remote control. Start by inserting the included AAA batteries into your remote control. Now you can operate the pan, tilt, and zoom of your camera using the IR remote. Let's set a camera preset up to familiarize ourselves with the remote control. First, click the number you would like to save a PTZ preset for and then click set. Then you can recall your preset using the numbers one through nine by pressing the number and then clicking the call button. If you would like to adjust the PTZ speeds, please do so on the on-screen display menu. Tip, if your remote control is not controlling your camera, double check the IR address your camera is set to. The default address is one. Let's press the number one button on the top of the IR remote control to make sure the IR remote is set properly. The IR remote control can control up to three HuddleCam HD cameras. You can gain control of a second or third camera by adjusting the camera's IR address address via the dip switches on the back of the camera. Tip, HuddleCam HD USB 3.0 cameras feature an on-screen display menu ideal for color correcting your camera's image to match the lighting scene inside your room and fine tuning the PTZ motors for your unique application. You may choose to mount your HuddleCam HD USB 3.0 camera to a wall using the recommended HCM-1 wall mount, which is available in either white or black from your local HuddleCam HD reseller. You may also ceiling mount the camera with a verified ceiling mount. We recommend the PTZ Optics ceiling mount PT-CM dash one dash BK. Note, if you plan to ceiling mount your HuddleCam HD USB 3.0 camera, you can invert the camera's image using the OSD menu. Look for the auto rev section and select N for inverted ceiling mount or P for a standard upright mount. An important note regarding USB 3.0 connectivity, USB 3.0 ports are backwards compatible with USB 2.0 devices. USB 2.0 ports are not completely forward compatible with USB 3.0 devices. Some USB 3.0 devices will connect to USB 2.0 but have limited functionality. External USB hubs should be avoided. Give the camera its own USB port on the device, as they are not well suited to transmit HD video reliably. USB extension systems must be fully compatible with the version of USB that you are using, and they must utilize an external power supply when required. Caution: Some compatible USB 3.0 extenders do not actually have the full 5 gigabits of bandwidth required for uncompressed HD video, so check bandwidth specs. Always connect the HuddleCam HD camera directly to the device in order to associate the UVC drivers before attempting to use any extension system. Finally, if you are interested in using the free HuddleCam HD PTZ camera control software on your Mac or PC computer, it is available for download at huddlecamhd.com resources. This software will allow you to control your camera from your computer using just the USB cable connection you're already using for video. You have now set up your HuddleCam HD camera and you can use it with your favorite video conferencing software. Remember, if you have any questions during your setup process that you can always call our support team using the phone number listed on our website. You can also submit a support ticket at any time at help.huddlecamhd.com. Enjoy!